it's a different animal altogether. Uh, defensively, definitely, you got you got to do some some things that are different, you know. But for the offensive side of the ball, it's great because our uh, wide receivers and our quarterback, they know they're they're working on their skill. They're working basically on their on their offensive package. You know, a lot of times you'll see a lot of people get off that single back formation and go into empty sets and whatnot. But it, it's great for keeping the kids, uh, you know, active and working on uh, part of the scheme anyway. Oh, it, 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 it would be great, really, you know, for us. It's uh, the more uh, games that we get, get in under our belts before we start football season, that's ideally what we're looking at. You know, we still got some question marks on uh, quarterback positions and wide receiver positions, so this gives us an opportunity to see them against someone else other than ourselves. Well, at the quarterback, we've got uh, Jesus uh, Cuellar and, uh, you know, Williams Arias, you know, that are uh, buying for that position. You know, uh, defensively, you know, we're filling in some spots in the secondary. And, again, it gives us a good uh, gauge to see who can play. You know, at bottom line, you know, at the varsity level, it's about production. And that's what I tell the players. You can produce, you'll be on the football field. If you can't produce, then don't, don't be whining, you know, if you don't find yourself on, on the field on Friday nights.